babies, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm back and I'm storing photo cards as per usual. Um, these are the cards I have to store in here, minus these white fillers. And um, I think I'm just gonna get into it. Yeah. Um, this is the only boy group card I have today too. So that's kind of sad, but we'll resume. So here is my boy groups binder. Um, I was thinking, like, I might drop some of my collections because, like, I don't know, like, some of my collections I don't enjoy as much. It kind of just feels like, okay, I have to get these cards. Like, it's not like, oh, I want to get these cards, you know? Like, I do feel that way kind of heavy about my NCT collections, low-key. I don't know. And also, my hands are, like, so dry right now. I put on lotion just now, but... Yeah, if they look dry, I'm so sorry. I switched to doing like gel manicures because usually I just wear normal nail polish, but I wanted to switch to like wearing gel and like soaking my fingers in acetone is just like drying the fuck out of my nails. But my nails do kind of look cute, no? Like, I don't know, nail tech who? Just kidding. I don't know. But that was all I had for Wavy. That's really sad. That was like the only boy group card I had. Especially because like I finished my TXT collection. So like I have nothing to collect for a while. And then, like, I don't know, when the new NTT subunit debuts, I don't know. Apparently, SM is debuting a new boy group as well this year. I thought it was just going to be a new girl group. So we'll see if I like any of those groups. Who knows? Maybe I'll collect one of the members or something. But, yeah, we're going to move on to my girl groups binder. Because, like, all of my cards today are for the ladies. Okay, here is my girls, blah, 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 my girl groups binder. Um, I, like, feel bad every time I film one of these videos, I'm like, oh, also I don't have anything set up for Espo's comeback, by the way, so, yeah, but I always feel bad when I get to my girl groups collections, because I always forget about, like, who I'm collecting, like, for example, I feel like I haven't been collecting Stacy that long, but I, like, never, I feel like I never have Stacy cards to put away, it's just frustrating, but I have three cards for Joy today, um, I have... The two from my video that I filmed starting my Joy collection, if you haven't watched that and you want to, go right ahead, it's like the last video on my channel, but I also have this card which hasn't been seen, this is one of Joy's rookie cards, there's a hair, yeah, one of her rookie cards, um, I think I'm going to put it down here, so I have this Joy and I mentioned in that video, but Joy is going to be a slow collection because from my friends who collect Red Velvet, they have said pretty much negative things about collecting Red Velvet. And, um, you know, I'm just going to take my time and try enjoy this, like try to enjoy this collection. But I have this Day 2 Joy, which is one of my favorite Joy photo cards. There's hairs on it. And, oh my gosh, when is Espa going to get like cute photo card backings, honestly? Red Velvet has like the cutest photo card backings, but yeah. And then I still don't have any white sleeves for these, um, so that kind of sucks. But I also have, lastly, this Queen Dom card for Joy. It's this Queen's version. This top reminds me of Karina's like Black Mamba top, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I can't talk right now, but I think it's really cute. I don't know. But now we can just skip to Stacy. I haven't done any fillers, but I actually have Stacy cards today. I have a couple. I have like five or something. It's not that many, but like, you know, it's better than having nothing. So let's see, I have one, two, three, four. I do have five. Wow. Okay, so let me organize these really quickly. Actually, no, it's not that bad. Um, the first card I have is for uh what is this called? ASAP ASAP. I can't talk. I have this Sayun. And I think I have her other one with the green hair on the way. So I just need to finish this. I have to get the Sumin, Shun, and Jay. Um, and I still haven't set up for Teddy Bear. I don't have anything for Teddy Bear. Like like I just said, I feel like I kind of forgot that I collected Stacy or that I started a Stacy collection. So I feel like I never have anything for them. Because I always forget to look for Stacy cards. You know what I mean? But I also have this really pretty Sayun card. I love this card actually. It's so nice. But I don't know, I'm just trying to like chill. I feel like I've slowed down like all my collecting on all my collections. Like 
the only collection i feel like now that i would like rush is my woods collection and i don't even like rush through my woods collection anymore i'm trying to like take time and just like you know not fucking rush shit i don't know i have this zoom in though um beret zoom in it took me a while to find this card i don't know if it's like popular or something but yeah it's kind of hard to find and i did buy it for like a dollar more than i would have wanted to i bought it for eight dollars i would have liked to buy this for like six or seven but that's fine i already paid for it so can't really complain there um and i also bought a ton of triple s cards um, so I'm so excited to get those. Like, Triple S is my new favorite thing right now. They've been, like, my new favorite thing for a while now. I just really like them. I have this J for We Need Love. This is, like, the power version. Slowly working on this era. This is actually, We Need Love era is, like, actually my favorite Stacey era. Beautiful Monster is my favorite Stacey song. Fun fact. Um, so I don't know why this era is just not possible for me. This is Isa's Digipack. But yeah, I've just been taking my sweet time. But now we have triple S. I have two cards to put away. Um, for triple S though, I have Crystal Eyes. Cherry Talk is coming out in less than 12 hours. I'm so excited. Um, I hosted a group order through Makestar for Crystal Eyes. I have like 20 albums on the way from that. And I am going to film an unboxing video because I feel like that'd be so cute, no? Like, just doing an unboxing of my group order albums because not I did have quite a few people ask for Unsealed, so I'll probably just go through everything, like the pops and stuff. But I have this Dahan. And I actually have this Soyeon, Hayden, Jiwoo, Sumin, and Yubin on the way. Um, so this whole first version will be done. And then I have this Hayden, Jiwoo, Cheon, and yeah, all the way. So I'm literally just missing Soyeon, Sumin, and Kaede for the second version, and then I'll have Assemble done. Um, so then I need to like backtrack and work on Acid Angel from Asia, and I need to work on Crystal Eyes when I get those albums, because I'll probably get dupe photo cards, you know what I mean? Like, and also I didn't order enough albums for myself to get, um, like enough photo cards to fully collect so i'll have to like buy some but if they do a fan call through make star i will probably host another go and buy more albums and try and get in because i would like to meet crystallize i think that'd be cool but i just have that for my triple s collection and that was everything for my girl group binder sadly but these pages will be filling out shortly and so i'll just need to work on Acid Angel, and then Crystal Eyes, which I haven't set up for, but it's like the same setup as Acid Angel from Asia, so I don't even think I'm going to, to be honest. That's just like unnecessary in my opinion, and I feel like I've been doing too many setting up videos lately, so I'm going to try and take a break from doing that. <laughs> Next, I have my Luna Binder. A few videos back, I got like, someone commented, but I think they deleted their comment, but I still, I took a screenshot of it because I was like, oh, that's smart. So they commented like certain binders and like pages to look for that are like binders that hold like 12 pocket pages. And I'm low key considering buying one. I think that'd be really cool to get a 12 pocket binder, but like one with like pages you can insert. Like I don't like the ones that have like the fabric -y pages that are like black and you can't see the back of the photo cards. So I may try and get, like, some of those. I think that would be really cool. But yeah, I just have this Yojin. Um, I need to freaking work on these attendance cards. I say that every single time, and yet I just don't. The next card I have is 4++. What was I talking about before? I can't remember. Mm. Um, oh yeah, about the, the binders. So I may try and look into that because I feel like for my Luna collection that'd be nice because this binder is just so bulky and I could save all these nine pockets if I were to swap because they fit 12 members and then for triple S they said to get it for triple S because um triple S in the end is going to have 24 members so like you know it'd be kind of smart I just have this BV plus plus B version this is just a reprint um I was 
thinking if I was gonna get any kind of like first press cards for like plus plus but I just see people sell them for like so much that I'm like I don't know I might try and get like a Jinsoul first press for like A and B version but I don't know but I have four done for this version so yeah maybe now I just need to get um Yojin and Chu to like fill up this page and then the other six but I don't know um, but next I have just stuff for Midnight. Sadly, I don't have anything for Hash. But I actually don't know what I have for Midnight, so hold on. I think all my cards are for the D version or something. I don't know. Wait, I kind of have a thick sock for Midnight. Oh, it's not thick, actually. I just lied. I have two... Oh, no, I have three D version, two C version cards. Okay, so never mind. I lied. Um, so we can just skip ahead here. And then I also put this card here because I mentioned before but in Hostel Spot I'm gonna do like the backings of cards because obviously she was not um, like active at the time. She was on her hiatus so she doesn't have any photo cards for this era. So, you know. And I just have Vivi and Kim Lip for this page. Yeah, my Luna binder is so sad, honestly. <laughs> I need to work on it so bad. It honestly makes me sad. Like, I really want to fill up this binder. Especially because who knows when Artemis, like, the Artemis project is going to, like, drop anything. You know, like, then what am I going to do? Um, also, for this page, I have this Heijin card. I totally forgot. But yeah, this is for the D version. I have this Heijin. So, I just need Hash Gym. That's crazy. For Kyunjin. And then I also have the final Jin Soul card I needed. Probably my favorite from the D, ver D version for her. Oh my god, I just cannot talk today. I like haven't really been talking to anyone today though. You know like, <laughs> right before I filmed this video, I was like gonna film this video. But I was like, okay, I want to finish watching this like one episode I'm watching on Netflix. Because I'm watching this like terrorism documentary. Yeah, don't ask. It's about terrorism though. Um, and I was watching that, and, um, when I opened Netflix, the first thing on it was Pitch Perfect, and I was like, I don't think I've seen that movie since that movie came out in theaters, so I watched that, um, and, yeah, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that, but, yeah, I watched that, and then somebody commented, a few people did, that they want to know what I'm watching, so I'm going to tell you guys, because... Some people said they, they, you know, they expressed their interest. Um, for this page, I have both of these flower Hyunjins. I actually was going to buy the, like, she has one that doesn't have these flowers, but the person sold it. Like, this person was selling their, like, Hyunjin and set and then, like, a few other cards from And. And, uh, unfortunately, I was not able to snag the other Hyunjin. So that kind of blows, but... It's okay, what was I saying? Um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah. So currently, I'm watching television shows. I don't ever watch TV shows. I like watch documentaries and sometimes movies. Um, but I'm watching Ted Lasso. I think I said that in one of my previous videos. Fucking love that show, I'm obsessed. And I also started watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine because um, I've been wanting to watch that show forever. I just never like made any effort to watch it, still need this fucking Hyunjin sticker, um, but yeah, I started watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine, crazy, I'm only like a couple episodes in, so like I'm not really anywhere significant in the show, but you know, I did start watching it, um, and so far I'm enjoying it, so you know, that's nice, for this B version of Flip That, I have this Hyunjin, Probably my favorite outfit of Hyunjin's for Flip That. So, so pretty. Um, so yeah, I started watching that. And I also wanted, I really want to watch It's Always Self Sunny in Philadelphia. Um, I'm pretty sure that show is actually still on air. Like, I'm pretty sure it's still running. But I've only seen like a couple episodes of it and I low-key want to watch like the entire show. So, I don't know. But for the C version, I have Tattoo Lip Bow Lip. I have this Kim lip, finally. So I'm only missing 
two and Eve for the C version, and then the popular cards for Flip That will be done. I'm so happy. Mm. But yeah, I have this lip, very cute. And um, I think I mentioned before, but for all my like popular Luna cards, I have them double sleeved just because like, gotta keep them extra safe, you know? Oh my God, and the person who was selling those Hyunjin cards also was selling Flip That cards and they had the last Heiju I wanted too, but that card was also gone. So I'm just struggling, I don't know. But for the D version, I have this Hyunjin. So pretty. I have so many Hyunjin cards. That was not intentional. But yeah, I have Hyunjins. We love her. But that was everything I had for my Luna binder, sadly. I would love to have more, but yeah. And then, and I think I talked about this before too, but I think when like the Artemis project thing debuts, I'll probably get them their own binder. Like I said, I'm looking into the binder for 12 pockets. I think that'd be really nice. Cause like this binder's heavy. And this binder is just gonna keep getting thicker as I put more photo cards in it. So like, I don't know, but I'm not gonna be adding anything else to this binder except for maybe expanding Hula Hoop Luminous and Multiply Multiply for OT12. But yeah, other than that, like, I'm not gonna be adding any new like eras to come forward for like Luna or Artemis or whatever their new naming is gonna be. Like, yeah, and I'm also probably gonna get Triple S Stone Binder because God, they have a lot of photo cards, so. Okay, here is my last binder to store photo cards for. This is my twice binder. I have cards for my top three and then I also have some cards for Chewy. I did a setting up my Chewy collection video and so I do, I'm not storing everything from that video away, but in that video I did set up for Chewy and I'm actually keeping her cards at the back of my binder as opposed to like putting them in the front here. So if you have an issue with that, you can cry about it because I don't care. First card I have is I have this Momo from lane one. This person I traded with, they just bought a card for me. I, I think I've already traded with them like three times in the past month. Never intentional, it just, that's just what keeps happening. Um, but I have this Momo for lane one. I was actually worried about getting this card, so I'm very happy to have found a trade for it. What did I trade for this card? I think it was like a The Year of Yes card or something. And then I just sold this person another The Year of Yes card. Um, but then I don't have anything until... Um, Formula of Love for my top three. And I still don't have this Momo. I tried to trade with that person for this Momo card. And then they said that it had been traded already. But then they reposted it, so... I don't know if they lied or their trade just like didn't go through, but... I have this Momo for this page. I'd like to call her flight attendant Momo. She looks like a flight attendant. Fun fact, I wanted to be a flight attendant, but I would rather not die in a horrific plane crash. So, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I love that. And then the next thing I have is for Pop. I don't know which version this card is for though. I have this Nyon. This card took forever to get to me. I got this card like two months ago and I just got it in the mail like uh, a week ago. So I don't know. I feel like my mail has just been so slow lately um, and I live in Cali. So like, and I have like other friends who live in Cali who collect and they said their mail has also been slow. So is that just like a statewide thing right now where like California people are just getting slow ass mail? I don't know. I'm gonna Google really quick what version this goes to. I had a feeling it was for the first version, I just wasn't sure, but yeah, this is the M version. Um, I'm gonna put it in the middle, I think, looking at the other two cards. Honestly, should I just like reverse this really quick? Do you know what I mean? Like, do it this way instead of doing like a layout or spread. So this is the M, Yan, and then the other page is the Na Pop version. <laughs> I don't know. And I also wanted to do like, the matching photo cards with these outfits like on top or like under so like this one is matching so like these outfits together and then when i get the one of her with the big fluffy hat it'll go here and then like this one will go here this one will go here do you know what i mean like i don't know anywhere um next i have <gasps> oh i thought i had this momo I don't know. 
And this one too, what the fuck? Maybe my mail just slow, I don't know. But for this page, I just have Sana's Target exclusive card. I have Momo's on the way. I also just can't find a trade for the Sana, so I don't know. I might just have to like buy it, which sucks, but yeah. But I have this Momo on the way, so I just need to find the Sana. You know what, maybe I'll just put this filler in here, even though I don't ever do fillers. I don't know. And then I also, pretty sure I have this Momo on the way, so. And then for this page, I have both of Nyons for my OT Nyons. Um, hold on. Okay, so for this first page, I have Nyon. I do have other members on the way. Like, I said it a million times already, I feel like. But my mail has just been so slow. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Um, and I also took down, like, all my templates on Instagram. I only have my Luna Woods and Triple S ones up these days because, like, I'm kind of tired of getting offers for, like, other groups. Or, like, you know when you post a trade and you're like, I only want this wish list, or I only want to sell, and then people offer to buy, or like offer you a random wish list, or even worse, when people offer you a card for a group you don't even stand or collect. Like, what is the point of that? So I just decided to take down all my wish lists except for my top three, with Luna and Triplos, and soon to be Artemis, <laughs> because like, I just can't stand it. It's so annoying to me. I don't know. Maybe I'm a terrible person though, so who knows? But now we can move on to like the last stretch of cards I have, which are for Tui. I have her page two cards. Um, I still need her lenti though. We have this page two for her. And then I don't have anything for this page. And then for what is love, I have her message card. Um, I did set all these up in my starting my Tui collection video. However, I did not organize all of these in like the order I want. So as I get all these cards or like as I fill out the page, I'll probably rearrange where some of these cards go. Like I probably don't want to put this dress card here. Like I probably wouldn't leave it there. I don't know. And then for Summer Nights, I have her plain border card. This one. Oh wait, we have to go back. I forgot, I put Chewy's The Year of Yes cards with my other, with my top three, because for her, I'm only collecting three of her cards as opposed to collecting all five of them. I have this one, but I'm collecting her one in like the blue plaid outfit, and then I'm collecting her one of her in the snow, so, you know. And then we can just skip ahead and I think this page is for formula but okay and then for um ready or what, what was the last era called between one and two yeah for between one and two i have her message card and then i have her archive one and her what were these called photography archive and pathfinder i don't know and also i just got the weirdest fucking craving for garlic fries. <laughs> okay, I don't know how many of you guys live in California, but if you've ever been to Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk, they have like the best fucking garlic fries there ever, and I'm like craving those so bad. I wanna go to Santa Cruz so fucking bad. I haven't been in like a few years. <laughs> okay, well anyway, that was everything I had to store for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. All my supplies are linked down below if you wanna follow me on Instagram. Here is my handle. Um, thank you so much for watching my video in full. I really appreciate it if you made this far. Um, if you want to subscribe, go for it. If you like the video, then like it. If you have any questions or comments or concerns or whatever, um, feel free to comment those down below. I try to respond to all my comments, but I don't always get notifications for comments. Uh, or like sometimes my comments get held for review, which I don't know why, because like I get the most random shit held for review. It's just like YouTube's like flagging system is just really broken. But when I do see comments, I do try and reply to them or like acknowledge them by liking them or whatever. So yeah. Anyway, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um yeah, that's all I have to say, I guess, for today. Have a great night. I don't know. Love you guys. You guys rock. <gasps> bye bye.
Thank <laughs> you.